I actually just got done with an episode with Myron recently. Super cool guy. Absolutely recommend going to check that out. Um, but yeah, wonderful underscore skip at Twitter. Follow me. I won't plug mine until the end. <laughs> <laughs> well, some of us are just a little more professional than others, huh? <laughs> no, no. It's also because the game's starting. You know what? What up? We got uh, Meister versus Dom game number one. Winner's finals. Let's go. Yo, no. No, I saw what you said. <laughs> My hair's not spiky enough for that. But we're going to be going into game one. And right there, man, the bucket coming out the play against the cross. <laughs> he just knew. He knew. <laughs> well, see, here's here's part of the problem, right? So if Dom throws out this, uh, this cross, right, and... Meister waits for it to like go underneath him. He can come back down and bucket it, and it's going to go through him, but he's going to be controlling it. So it's not like he's just reflecting it back. It's just kind of like it's still taking the same project, uh, um, trajectory or path or whatever, but it's just he owns it now. And it's just a matter of if can Dom recognize that. Ooh, there's the bucket again. I'm telling yeah. you, man, this bucket is going to be such, such a big uh, factor in this matchup. I'll have to see if Dom can find his way around it, though. Yes, it's a little bit different from other reflectors because, for one, it can absorb the uh, holy water and it can reflect everything else. So, like, it's just nuts. Really, sure, really yeah. good. And if he continues to uh, absorb this holy water as well, um, he could actually fill up his bucket, which could put down some uh, probably a really solid 30% damage um, if he can get it out. But, man, that bucket's putting in some work here. This is going to be such a tough matchup for Dom. This is so unfortunate, man. I ain't biased. I ain't biased. Though. I, you know, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, good luck to both players. Although, I mean, Dom is the under uh, underdog. So I mean, you know, yeah. Wait, okay. So here's part of the thing. As soon as Dom can like start opening uh, Meister up, uh, Meister or not Meister, Game Watch is like the third or second lightest character in the game. Mm -hmm. I think third. Uh, he, he could die very, very soon if Meister is not careful. And then Dom's been on top of his stuff all day today. He could absolutely find an early stock, almost getting one right there. Yeah, you got that aimbot, man, with the whip. Look at that aimbot! The aimbot! <laughs> <laughs> someone needs a, if someone does a montage for this tournament afterwards, if you do a montage for Dom, I need to see, like, every time that whip hits, I need to see that, what is it, that, that Airsoft uh, videos where they put the little, the reticles with the little hit sounds. <laughs> I need to see those edits in here, man. <laughs> yeah, I want the hit markers so bad. <laughs> yeah, I want the hit markers on. <laughs> look, at, look at these aerials, man. He's so on point with these. Oh, my God. Oh, but good on Meister for actually catching that uh, that tether right there. Very, very well, very well done. Wow. Yep, and the bucket full. Okay, only putting about 20% damage on there. Did he just absorb the, the whole fire water or holy water? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Yo, yeah, did no, he just uh, down me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but no, like, uh, Tom, Tom's doing a really good job actually really making this competitive. It looked rough at first, but I think he just needed that time to kind of like be like, okay, this is the game plan, obviously, that I have to go with. This is what I'm dealing with at the moment. He's doing a really good job keeping that spacing up. These aerials have been really on point, and these tilts have actually been uh, putting in a lot of work for him. So it's a matter of can he keep this going right now? Because right now it's looking pretty good. He's looking clean. And right there with the up smash, he's taking a really solid lead. <laughs> Sorry, I had to put it in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> what did you put down? Yo, did he no, just yo, bucket? Did he just bucket? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be a staple in this game. <laughs> I mean, it, it's if you got a tool that beats a character, use that tool. Oh yeah, I you don't know. Care, I don't care what somebody says about your character. If you have a tool that beats somebody, use it. Yeah, like Pikachu with back air against Ganondorf, you know? Oh! oh he jumped right into the axe. That now was take game nuts. One at a two stock situation. Yo, uh, Jesus! Meister might be in trouble. He needs to find his way to a small stage quick. I'm actually kind of surprised he went PS2. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, me too. Honestly, yeah, that, that's that is a bit weird. Uh, but you know what I'm thinking of right now? You know that meme with like the Reaper just going through the, the different doors with the, the blood on the ground and everything? Yeah, that's Dom right now. Dom is just going around taking souls. Oh my god! Yeah, dude, he's uh he's killing it, man. Um. That's a cherry coke, if you heard that. <laughs> he even has the Reaper profile pick. He got, like, bro, it's fitting. Yeah, man. Um, dude, okay, so look. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. When I saw Dom's name blasted through this bracket, and I saw that he was, like, facing MKLeo right before top eight, I said, who the hell is this guy? I'm like, is this Stroder with another name change? 
because he's been doing that. Like, I think what's his uh his, his most recent name is like E Boy Tom Nook. And I'm like, okay, maybe he just did another uh, name change, just to kind of mess around or whatever. And I went into this guy and I'm like, this is a completely different dude. Who is this guy? And man, let me tell you, he has been killing it. If you do not know Dom's name, you better know it after today. It's your next, if not. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, yeah, we're going to be going to Smashville here. Uh, interesting uh, stage choice. I think it's a good stage choice for Meister, but, like, I don't know because, like, <laughs> Dom's been controlling a lot of space. And when you give him smaller room to kind of, like, continue to put pressure onto you, I don't know if that's a good idea. Yeah, this is an interesting stage pick from Meister. And I'm actually willing to see, like, you know, what, is, what he got in his mind. You know, he, got to, he has to have a plan, you know. Yeah. He has to have some kind of plan right here. Well, because, like, I know a lot of the times, and, like, I'm not going to say Meister's like any other care, uh, player. Uh, going to maybe take out that first sma uh, first stock with the smash attack. But um, but most people, like, when they're, like, dealing with a zona character, they instantly want to go to these smaller stages. And I don't blame them. It's because you have less room to chase them around. And maybe that's what he's looking for. But, like, I felt like even then, like, even though we were on PS2, Dom was using, like, the space. Uh, he, was, he's, he was so aggressive the whole way through. And he was doing a really good job of controlling just the space, just with keeping Game of Watch just at that range where he's able to get his hits. Mm -hmm. So like, I don't, I don't know. This is it's gonna be very interesting to see how this plays out. Um, almost taking out that Yeet. stock right there. <laughs> oh, there. Oh, okay, the up tilt not gonna kill either. And that back here gonna clean that up mm -hmm. right there. Uh, Dom is. Behind, technically, by like 40%. We'll have to see if he can just, uh, find a way to turn this around. But right now, Meister's is opening him up at the moment. Pulling down this damage. Ooh, that was really good by Meister. Go for that. Ooh. Yeah, no, that was actually could have been a stock uh, very easily. Dom definitely struggling with... That was a uh, jump. Yeah, he's dead right there. Yeah, he took yeah, his jump. It. No, good stuff from Meister actually finding a way... Uh, off stage and just finding out the finding that early stock. I think that's going to be a, such a big part uh, in the rest of this matchup here. I feel like this actually might turn into a game of counter picks, if I'm being honest here. You think so? Oh, there's a little bit of lag there. Uh oh. Hang on, let me get the sable detect up, y'all. Hang on. It apparently, it wasn't on. All right. Well, the, the game the game stopped. Okay, there we go. <laughs> oh, my bad. My bad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's all good. And right there, going to be able to get that bucket in there, putting some extra damage. But right now, it seems like... All right. We'll have to see if Dom can close out this stock soon because it is looking tough. He's definitely throwing out these aerials and these forward tilts, trying to get Meister off stage. Not going to kill him quite there, but maybe he could find another aerial here or a forward tilt. I don't think he should have jumped right there. Unfortunately, going to whip on that forward air and going to take a little bit of punishment from Meister. Yeah, Meister has the advantage of that up B. He's like, if he gets oh, if he gets holy it. water, he just up B's him. Oh, yeah, there it is. <laughs> Yo, he went out there for some disrespect at the end there. Tried to get a little hammer kill at the end. That was a one, uh, by the way. That was a one. <laughs> <laughs> so we actually took damage for that. But, um, yo, super good stuff, man. Uh, Meister played that game the way he needed to play it. He found those early stocks off stage. He said, "Okay, I've got, I've got Dom way off stage. I'm gonna go out there, just throw out my long-lasting back air, which lasts forever. Um, it's gonna hit him. It's gonna send him out further. He's mm -hmm. not gonna be able to recover because Belmont just cannot do that at all. Yep. So super good stuff from uh, Meister there and finding a way to get that game too." Yep, and we're gonna see a looks like a stage counter pick. So yeah, this is definitely gonna be the battle of the counter picks, like you said. Mm -hmm. But I don't see I, I, Meister going to change anything. So it might be a character change. Oh, I lied. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I don't know. I feel like Dom is just a uh, a Belmont all the way through. Yeah. Well, I did see someone in chat say that uh, he plays Paltana as well. He has a Paltana, so who knows? I mean, I don't think it'll help that much against Game of Watch. Because I think that's still a bad, very, very bad matchup for Palu. You know? Yeah, but it's still still probably a lot better than Belmont. But, like, yeah, I think he's, I think he's good sticking with the Belmont here. We saw in game one the type of pressure that he was able to put on when he got going. And, like, man, that was just a freight train that couldn't be stopped. Yeah, definitely. But here we are, game number three on FD with Warrior Wear play. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Wario, we're sick, man. This is this is the song I throw on 
when um <laughs> when I'm playing Smash Bros. If I'm hosting an arena, <laughs> Warrior Wear main theme is playing. Oh my god, I hate I hate the update. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, no, I mean I, I love it, man. Battlefield, uh, Final Destination, all got buffed. Uh, being able to play every song in the game, and I think that's how it should be. When you got these two stages that are supposed to be representing the Smash Bros. series, they should be representing every series in, in, that's in Smash Bros. That's the way I see it. Yeah. I am happy about that update. You know, you're you're, all, you're able to do so much more now. And oh my Whoa. God! Oh. Yo, that, that aimbot coming into play, man. Target acquired. Zip. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. But yeah, no, that back air almost closing that out. Oh, he's he's scouting him out there. He got the cross and just wasn't able to convert off of it. But boy, he was looking for it. All right, that nair not going to do too much. Going to back throw him off stage. Yep, he's looking to get the stock. Oh, upbe. Yep. Oh, he's not gonna be able to get. Oh, oh no, he's no, made no. It back. Oh yeah, yeah. His air dodge is too. Oh, what, the, what the hell was that? Now I'm coming back. To the first thing. What was it? The like cross? Yo, I need a sip of water after that one. The heck? Oh my god. Yeah, getting the uh, the little uh, the Belmont Dolphin slash there. Uh, closing out the. You saw like <laughs> three seconds into the future. <laughs> oh man. Oh, he's got the holy water in hand. All right. Oh, so yeah, the holy water is actually held by um, Game of Watch there, and he actually knocked that out of his hand, so he ended up taking a little bit of damage for that. Ooh, just gonna run up and forward throw him. Oh, dude, he's getting so much going. Now he's gonna eat those apples. Yep, get some of that health back. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah, this is definitely getting a little tough, man. Yep, there it is, man. He's looking to close out these stocks. Oh, early. yeah, that's it. Oh, man. Yeah, dude. No, Meister's playing this exactly the way he needs to be playing. Yep, it. he has um, to get him. I don't, yeah, I don't blame him. Like, because, like, as soon as you leave him on stage, the longer you leave him on stage, the more he's going to be able to get all his stuff going here. And that's just going to create a much bigger uh, problem for Game & Watch in general and for Meister. So if he's able to just kind of get out there and just take those cheese stocks, just get it out of the way, man, because otherwise... You could be losing this. It could be a lot closer to um, uh, to what game one looked like. Yeah. Ooh, good forward tilt. Did he just eats the holy water? Yeah, dude, he's eating everything right now. Oh, oh that was a lot of God, damage yep. out of that uh, the bucket. Getting the oil spill. Yep. Even though it's the weakest bucket, it still does twenty damage. It's yeah, at minimum, by the way. So it's still nuts. All right. Not going to get that kill, that back air, unfortunately. Oh, he's going to get right there. The holy fire at the ledge. Getting him off there. And <laughs> part of my language. And getting the back air to close that out. Did somebody say bucket? <laughs> yeah, bucket coming into play again. Okay, so it looks like Dom's starting to play a bit more passive here. And I don't blame him. I knew it. Oh. That's exactly what I would have done right there, too. <laughs> so I can't yeah. play Meister at all. That was dope. Oh. That was dope, Meister. I see you. I see you. <laughs> oh my God. Ugh. Yo, that was that was very very well played by Meister there. Super good job. Just um, ultimately just just playing that the way he should have been playing it the whole time. Game two definitely showed that he he's like, all right, here's the game plan. And then game three, it's like, obviously this is working. I'm gonna keep doing it because um, the, the first two stocks, he just I, I'm not gonna say he cheesed them, but like. He got Bellama off stage. He got the back air. So Dom's got to find another way out of there because that back air is killing him, man. It's making him lose stocks at like 30%. I'm turning up the volume. It's a little bit quiet. I'll help y'all out. Can y'all hear it better now? Let me know if that's a little, a little bit louder. Man. I still think that... <laughs> It's like he saw three seconds in the future. I'm talking about Dom, by the way. Dom, like, just that entire play and that, like, second stock. Oh, my God. Now, listen. If Dom, I'm telling you, if Dom doesn't win this uh, this set, he's already got the clips, man. He's got the clips. You got clips. If you lose the set, but you got clips, you kind of didn't lose. Who's the real winner? Sure. Yeah, like, really. <laughs> but he is definitely looking to take this. Taking him back to Final Destination here. I think this is a good call. Um, he was definitely in control for, I think, a large majority of, um, of this last game. It's just he got caught in some really bad scenarios off stage. So I'll have to see if he can find a way to get around those. A oh, good bucket right there. Making that Holy Cross come back and actually putting more damage down on the Dom. Oh, he went for <laughs> Yeah, he went for the Game & Watch special. Yep. Avatar State. <laughs> oh, weird. I don't think he wanted the Holy Fire there. That was kind of strange. 
right. Okay, Dom spacing's actually been really, really good here. There we go. See, now he's scouting out this uh, this back air from Meister. Um, doesn't want anything to do with this uh, this turtle. He, okay, the up, uh, up special. Not going to take out the stock there, but that's still a good a little bit, uh, bit of damage. Oh, this is a scary spot to be in. Oh, that was dangerous. It Ooh. Like. Ooh. Wait, wait, wait. That was, was that oh, calculated? Kill. I wish he got that stock. That Dude, was so same. sick. It's like that's calculated. Oh my god, that's no, dope. Dude, he, he definitely knows what he's doing. He's actually thrown this uh, cross off stage a few times. Gonna clean up that first stock mm. right there with the forward air. But you know, when he's off stage, he'll throw that cross. Um, oh, more Ooh. damage. Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> no, super good stuff from Meister there. Uh, mashing out that up special, to trying to get out of a really bad scenario. Uh, super good stuff. Yo, Dom, slow down, man. I'm trying to keep up what you're doing. I, I, you know, this is too fast for me. Come on now. Dude, he's doing so well. He's uh, doing less. <gasps> oh! The oil spill. It's such a long lasting hitbox. Comes out frame two. It's just, it's it's nuts. Yeah, no, but super good um, uh, recognition from Meister to be able to throw that out and close out that stock. So, I mean, can't do nothing but praise him. Uh, but it looks like Dom's starting to take a little bit less time to uh, not trying Ooh, to. Uh -oh, is he dead? Uh-oh. Okay, no, we good. Okay, yeah, just jump. But yeah, he's doing less with the... Uh, the what's it call? Uh oh, oh, bro. Okay, he didn't die. But yeah, he's doing less with the projectiles. That is what I've been trying to say for the past 15 seconds. Uh, and it looks like he's trying to go more for these aerials and these tilts instead, uh, which I think is gonna is pretty good right now, especially just because Game of Watch doesn't seem to have too much of an answer once he's got these um these uh these aerials and these forward tilts going up because like they're it's almost like he's a sword character at that moment, and that's what Game of Watch struggles with a lot. That's very good to use that bucket at the ledge there. Gives him a good get up option. Oh, well, didn't help there. Never mind. I lied. Forward throw. Yeah, that forward throw gonna send him way off stage. Taking that stock. We'll have to see how. Do oh no, another bucket. <laughs> Man, that bucket is gonna be the death of Dom right now. No. Yeah, it's really unfortunate the situation. But I mean, we'll have to see what Dom's able to bring to the table on this last stock here, because otherwise, this is the end of his winner side run. He need he needs to find a way to close this out and fast, but. Again, Meister's not just going to sit down and take it. You have you have to beat Meister. You can't just sit there, and Meister's just going to sit there. I mean, he's holding shields. He's kind of sitting there, but <laughs> you, you, have, you have to go at him. You have to close out this game because Meister's been here before, man. He knows how to play it for the long run. Oh, he went deep for that. Mm, oh, deep. my God. Such a perfectly placed holy water. Oh, that was so good. Hey, we're going to a game five, Skiff. We're going into a game five situation. Now, this is going to be tough because Dom has to ban two stages and hope that um, Meister doesn't pick a stage and that puts Dom in a bad spot. Yep, that's and true. I think what we're doing um, DSR or MDSR or whatever. Oh. Uh, his last win yeah. on Final Destination. So... He's kind of got everything else open to him right now. Yeah. But man. I mean, look. I don't even know, man. Dom is just, he makes me speechless. I can't even, I don't even know what to say sometimes. He's just nuts. Oh my God. Dude, he's just so talented, man. There's he just, is. There's nothing to really say about it. <laughs> like, the guy, the guy's good. <laughs> Uh, but again, he is currently in a game five situation, winner's finals with Meister. Um, one, you don't make it this far in a tournament this stacked being okay. Yeah. You don't go to game five winner's finals with Meister being okay. Oh, yeah. Dom has been playing so well. And this guy, this guy's so good. Uh, <laughs> like, I don't know. It, it's, it's, it's been one hell of a run. Uh, super excited that he's made it this far because, boy, nobody thought this was happening. I'm going to be honest, man. I'm sure there's some Dom supporters out there who are like, nah, Dom's our guy. Dom can beat anybody, and I'm all for that. But, man, I was not expecting all this today. Yeah, definitely. And one thing I like that uh, Dom did that, that last game that I didn't see him do before, unless I just, I'm just blind, um, was that when he was trying to recover on stage, he threw the cross, like, away from the stage and then it came back and it was going like it was a good way for him to recover because it hit meister while he was on the stage so i don't know i thought that was pretty interesting because he almost like converted that into something oh no Ooh, this could be a tough stage i'm talking, I'm talking about the music 
This is this is Game and Watch music. It's Flat Zone Two. Uh oh. Oh no! Is it already in the books? <laughs> is the prophecy foretold? Oh no. Oh no! It might be. <gasps> the zero to death. No. This might be it. <laughs> Although we'll see. We'll see if Dom is able to. Uh... <laughs> we'll see if Dom is able to bring this back. Uh, either way, no matter who loses here, there's still a loser's run to be had. And Dom's starting to put down some damage here. So maybe, maybe we'll see a bit of a comeback. Nah, they, that, that didn't let him lose his momentum there. He's like, all right, I'm mad at that first stock. I'm going to take it out on you. <laughs> well, who else is going to take it out on you? <laughs> I mean, yeah, you know. <laughs> oh, my God. Meister getting fat damage right now. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, dude. It's just such a bad spot because, like, the Belmonts already have bad uh, airspeed in general. And now you got to deal with this really weird scenario. Yeet. All right. There we go. Get back on stage. No problem. Okay. Now there's problems. <laughs> All right, so he started off this uh, second stock here doing really well, building up a lot of damage, but it seems like Gaming Watch is starting to find, or Meister is starting to find his momentum here, uh, which is good because Meister is going to want to close this out as fast as possible because, as I mentioned before, the longer this game goes, uh, okay. the longer uh, this game goes, the more it's going to benefit Dom in general because he's just got all these projectiles that just are going to rack up damage and eventually kill you anyway. Yeah. Ooh, well, looks he's right there with the back here. Tilting <gasps> that up too. He hit him with the holy water, and then he got he got him with the eye frame. Oh, he went past the eye frame. That's dope. All right, but here here's it. Okay, so 98%. Uh, Dom's able to build up this damage and make this game competitive. Uh, we could absolutely have a game five, uh, an actual competitive game five situation here. Because right now, man, he's looking pretty good. He's just got to find a way to kind of rack up this damage here without taking too much or getting sent off stage. All right. He's back. You see what I mean by that? The cross, that's, oh, what, that's that. what I'm talking about. Yeah, he throws it away from cross? the stage. It's <laughs> dope. He's like, he's, that cross is like, hey, nice sausages. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Take this. Oh, the catch. Holy water in hand. Oh. All right. Back on stage, so 132%. He, there he is, yep. Oh, what a good up B right there. Wow. Actually catching him out of the tether. <laughs> Super good stuff from Meister. Great recognition. All right. Let's see what happens through the rest of this game, though. I mean, Dom could absolutely bring this back. He's just got to find a way to, you know, get some consistent damage here in this game and watch. But Meister's been really well, uh, doing really well, staying, uh, you know, not not too stationary, uh, being very slippery, and it's just kind of being a real annoyance, which is what he needs to do anyway, and he's doing a hell of a job at it. Oh, yeah. And Meister's just bullying Dom at this point. It's, yeah. Oh, it's that, unfortunate. that first stock was super unfortunate. However, mm -hmm. we could see a... Uh, oh! <gasps> Ow! Okay, that's not what's going to happen there. <laughs> turn your aimbot back on, Dom. <laughs> well, I mean, he, he could he could absolutely turn this around. Uh, he builds up. He gets the stock out of the way and is able to get like a good 40-50% damage. If he can get a uh, Holy Water forward smash um, to, to go off, he could absolutely win this game but it's just a matter of is he going to get it to happen on meister <laughs> yeah because <laughs> meister meister just continues to smother him man yeah oh and he just oh. throws out the up smash why not no. he threw the up smash out and dom went for the grab and actually because when he leaned back he missed him actually yep 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 <laughs> oh man meister taking game number five yeah uh, super good stuff what a competitive set uh, shout outs to Dom, man. You're, you are killing it, dude. Um, but we're going to end up seeing Meister game five, moving on to grand finals. Um, man, what, what a, what a hell of a top eight yeah. so far. This tournament has been killing.